these guys saw each other just a couple of weeks ago. Saw each other, each other just a couple of weeks ago. However, no one was able to take the victory in any matches throughout this year. They drew every time they played each other. It's going to be a good match. So here is Franks to take the corner kick. Shiplani short. Here's back to Capono Low. Capono Low just plays in the box. He gets a touch on it. And just not enough. It looked like two Railhawks in the same place. Coming on the counterattack. If he can switch this over to Shiplani, he can. Shiplani gets to it. He's still got Gary in the middle. Shiplani one on one. He loves it. He breaks it. He plays it through the shot. And a soft shot. And it looked like Shriver maybe wasn't expecting the dummy. Capono Low hammers this one out only as far as Savage, though, right there in the middle of the field. Here's Court to take a shot and hit well and hard, but too far off the goal. Shiplani, a quick header right into the path of Schreiber. He's got the speed. He breaks Shiplani. Shiplani's got space. No one's going to catch him. He takes the shot. And right at Jeff Antonella. Lowry plays the ball in quick. A nice flick from Gary. He's got Shriver. The ball's still on sides. And he tries to curl it in the top left corner. But some good work from Carolina. Kalunji, long ball, looking for Shiplani. If he can stay on sides. And he does. And here it comes again. Shiplani versus Arango, part three. Shiplani steps over him. He's got the ball back in a shot. And over the goal. Here's Shriver. He's got Gary in the middle. Shiplani on the outside. Does he see Shiplani? He does see Shiplani. Shiplani takes a shot and was trying to curl it in that left corner. Here's here. Franks. Shriver's on sides. If he can stay on side, here he goes. There's a shot. And not well hit again by Shriver. And of course, he did have a defender on him, Luke, but he did have the space to get around Antonella. He's got Arangos on the outside. This falls to Mulholland. Mulholland's got a little bit of speed. Plays the ball from Campbell. There's Hill. And a great block there by Stockley as Hill really wound up on that. Long ball played in. The ball headed down, but only as far. And that was on the outside. Looks like a Rango there. And here come the Railhawks, four on five. Franks plays an early ball to Shriver. If he can get Gary, just play it through. Ooh, and Rodriguez there interrupts the play. Lucky that that doesn't bounce a different way. It goes right to Antonella. That's right. And, and when you've got a two-leg series, that And here's more. Zimmerman. He tries to get around the back defender. And a, just a quick toe poke over the top. Just a little bit too high, but just great alertness from Zimmerman there to get around that defender. Ball played in. Rodriguez heads it out. Shiplani. Shiplani tries to get around the defense and take a shot. And that net one never had a chance. And there is the whistle. Here come Tampa Bay. Here's Stuart Campbell. He's going to wind up take a shot. And that one off the frame. Plays into space for Franks. He's got Lowry. Lowry's going to dial this one up. Instead, he goes to Shiplani on the outside. Shiplani breaks, takes a shot. Oh, and it just misses the far post. Shiplani does a great job beating his man to the right. Looked like a Rango there, and he just misses it by inches. Now this breaks for Tampa Bay. Here's Ambersley on the outside. No other green jerseys. Burst comes out to get it. Burst gets one hand on it, plays the ball back into Hill, and misses the goal. But Burst, I tell you, he came out to get that save, but made it dangerous. Zimmerman, Shriver. <laughs> It could all be for naught. Look at Shriver with pace. Takes a shot, and it hits the outside of the net. Boy, people got excited because that net did shake, but it was the outside. Here's Hill for Tampa Bay. Controls. He's got Savage. Ambersley's in. He takes a shot, and it's a goal for the Tampa Bay Rowdies. Ambersley got in there, beat his man, and the Carolina Railhawks frustrated because they let him through. Uh, when they really had no business allowing that. And Ray Burst clearly frustrated there. Here comes Shriver. He's got Shiplani. Gray on the outside. Shriver's making the run. He can play it to him. He's on sides. The ball gets flicked in, and there's Shiplani. And he doesn't get enough on it. It's a saving tackle from San Filippo. San Filippo does a great job there to shut down that play from T. Shiplani. And there's that connection again. Oh, Shiplani and Shriver doing a very good job. Out wide to Shriver. Schreiber flicks it in, and it's headed out. And now it's just going to be clear. Back to Luzineris. Shiplani 
Franks, and did he go down? He points to the spot, it's a penalty for Carolina. And the Tampa Bay Rowdies are storming the referee there. Four players surrounding the referee, and one of them gets a yellow card. Driver versus Atanella here at Wake Med Soccer Park to tie the game in the 77th minute. The shot, and it's a goal! Carolina Railhawks, Brian Shriver. A little bit of redemption there for Brian Shriver after all the missed chances. He's done such a good job of moving and passing, and now for him to get this penalty kick goal allows his confidence to stay intact. You see on the replay here, makes no mistake about it, drills it into the top right. Jeff Antonella, no chance there. And the Railhawks are now tied here 1-1 in the 78th minute at Wake Med Soccer Park. Franks is at the 18 as well, and he plays it back to him. Franks takes a shot, and it's cleared out by Tampa Bay, only as far as Palacios. Now he's going to whip it back into Kalunji. It hits Luzanaris. And it looked like it might have hit a Tampa Bay player. So Mulholland once again over the ball. Plays the ball in, he's got somebody running from the back corner, and Burst does a great job of getting out and getting that one. Antoniak had snuck in behind that defender and was right on top of that. San Filippo. There's Frimpong getting his first touch. He has a hold on it, plays it in. There's Antoniak, and it's a goal for the Tampa Bay Rowdies. A beautiful play from Frimpong to Antoniak. Antoniak made no mistake on that cross. He just puts it past Ray Burst. Try to put him over the top. Yamada. Yamada's just going to clear this one out. Shriver's not going to get to it. Yes, he is. He keeps it in play. A couple orange jerseys in the box. There's Luzanaris. Oh, and Luzanaris just misses it. Antonella came out and could have been the difference there, but they're saying it will be a goal kick. Franks gets it out to Elenio. Nice touches from Elenio. Plays the ball into Shiplani, heads it over to Luzanaris, back to Shiplani! And there's the defense coming up big again, Rodriguez and Yamada there for Tampa Bay. Palacio plays it up, only as far as Capono low. And there's the final whistle where the score at Wake Med Soccer Park, the Carolina Railhawks won, the Tampa Bay Rowdies two.